Hello everyone, Rich Barbara back again with another episode of Title Buzz. So today we're going to talk about the difference between the escrow agent and the closing agent. So when you're a buyer and you're looking to acquire real property, if you're working with a realtor, right, sometimes um, when you submit the offer, the realtor will have you provide the realtor to the, you know, to the realtor's company, your initial deposit, right? And so uh, on the first page of the contract, you'll see that on the line for escrow agent, it'll say, you know, um, real estate empire, for example. The issue there is that the escrow agent is not always the closing agent. The closing agent is the party that takes care of closing the transaction, issuing the title policy to the buyer, um, you know, sending off the payoffs and all the funds, etc. And the escrow agent just holds escrow. If you are in a financed transaction, in other words, if you're a buyer and you get a loan, all the money eventually has to go through the title, the closing agent's escrow account so there's gonna have to be a move of that money and that's an extra moving part that we want to avoid uh, in a real estate closing we want to have as few moving parts as possible because it makes things a lot smoother so my recommendation is if you don't already have a closing agent title company or real estate lawyer while you're making offers you should because that will make the realtors life easy it'll make your life easy and it'll make your transaction smoother as you approach closing if you have any questions I'm happy to help rich Barbara Coral Gables title and escrow Thank you.